Hello and welcome back. This is George Crump, Senior Analyst with Storage Switzerland. Uh, just wrapping up our first set of testing on the Unitrans uh, Rapid Recovery uh, Appliance. The last thing we're going to show you today is a uh, restore of a single file. And so we're going to, obviously with a name like Rapid Recovery, you'd want the re restores to work. So what we're going to do is restore uh, some data from a particular uh, group. We'll do it from the master backup of our backup server here, or our file server. And the way you do that is you uh, go into the latest backup that you might have, uh, hit restore, and then once that's done, you'll see a browsable tree that you can recover from that allows you to uh, drill through and, and find the specific files you want to recover. So we'll go through and we'll go recover something from one of our volumes. Uh, we'll recover something from uh, our virtual machines. And then what we'll do is we'll recover uh, maybe an ISO or something uh, just to uh, show that it all works. So we'll recover a uh, ISO of a Windows 2008 eval. Uh, and we want it to not go back to where it came from, so let's have it go to a directory that we've made there called slash temp, or temp. And uh, just to show you, we'll, we'll jump into that uh, system here. Here it is, uh, our server. And there's the directory temp, and you can see at least a, as far as it stands right now, uh, it's empty. So everything should be ready to go. So we'll have it go ahead and recover by pressing the restore button. And it'll let us know that it's beginning to restore those files. Uh, and then it's uh, got it queued up. And then we are uh, pretty much ready to go. And if we go to the tools menu, job status, uh, can see that we have a restore request uh, being sent to the client right now and then it's uh, a restore uh, of that system so we'll pause for just a few seconds here and let that recovery happen and uh, show it to you as we kind of progress along okay we're back and there uh, just a few seconds have gone by actually and the uh, restore request is underway. We've got another update coming here. The, the job tab refreshes every 30 seconds. See, we were 24% complete. We're now 64% complete. So moving along quite nicely, and we should be done with our recovery here pretty quick. This is a decent sized file. It's, a, it's an ISO image of an entire Windows DVD. Uh, so uh, certainly not a small restore uh, by any stretch of the imagination. We'll let that restore go ahead and complete up. But you can see there it was relatively easy. We drilled right to it. We click restore, and uh, everything happened pretty quickly, uh, which is really what we'd expect. We're almost done, about 89% of the way in. Um, so overall, our uh, first uh, uh, thoughts on the Unitrends uh, Rapid Recovery Appliances are uh, very positive, very simple to set up, plug it in, get going. I mean, this is enterprise strength backup, and we were up and running, and and certainly in just a few minutes, in future videos, we will show you adding a client and things like that. Uh, here comes our next refresh, and the task is complete. So with that done, we will jump over to our host, uh, our target machine. And you can see that it recreated the uh, directory path for us, and here is the, the file itself. So we could uh, go ahead and... Uh, pull that into a VM instance if we wanted to or something like that. So it uh, worked, worked very, very well. Uh, recover time was uh, pretty quick. That was a, it was a three gig file. That's you know, certainly not a full server recovery, but certainly not small either. Uh, so uh, overall worked very, very well. And um, uh, as I said, our, our initial uh, thoughts on this uh, product are uh, extremely positive, uh, really gets the job done. Uh, in in uh, up, upcoming videos, we'll show you how to add clients and, and do other things throughout the software, as well as explain uh, some more feature functionality. 
So again, thank you very much for tuning in. This is George Crump, and we will uh, talk to you again soon.